Welcome back to Stardew Valley, everybody. Thanks for joining me again. Elise told me I need to start watching TV. Which is, I mean, you know, I, I, I got no problem with that. Welcome to Kozu, your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. Now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful, sunny day. So it's a good way to know the weather, obviously. But also, there's apparently something going on with this. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. Noted. Bear, bear noted. All oh, right, I blew up my house. <laughs> I forgot. Um, hold on. So we have we have some furnaces to rebuild. As I uh, unfortunately dropped a bomb by my front door last night. I don't think I recovered the majority of the resources for those, though. Unfortunately, I think we're uh, I think we're lacking a little bit here. I gotta rebuild my little wooden path too. Shit. Come by the shop and check out the new rods I'm selling. They're the best money can buy. And you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Ooh, fun. I wouldn't mind getting a new rod, Willie. Most important part of this, obviously, is to rebuild the path. There we go. Get that fixed up at the very least. Uh, let's see here. How do we do this? First of all, I guess I'm going to replant the hops, but not really. I think I'm just going to leave the crops as is. I'm mostly going to focus on rebuilding these furnaces. So we need copper ore for that and coal, if I remember right. Which we might not have a lot of copper ore left over. I feel like I turned most of it into copper bars at this point, so I might only be able to build like one, if, if even that. Oh, it's stone. Never mind. And yeah, we absolutely don't have enough ore for it. I wonder if there's something else I could build instead. Like a better version of the furnace, maybe? Or is that not a thing yet? There's a worm bin. Produces bait on a regular basis. The worms are self-sufficient. That's cool. Do I have hardwood? Do I have 15 hardwood? I know I have some hardwood. I don't think I have that much, though. Yeah, not quite. That'd be neat. Do you think you still need three? Not really. Maybe I can just go find enough copper and stone and... Maybe the one will be enough. Go ahead and water our crops, though. So we still need to do that. Still need to go say hi to Chubbs. Say good morning to my boy. New DD mod, yeah, just trying out. Groovy. Makes the experience radically different. It's almost like we're playing a totally different game. Oh, it's new hops. Nice. Didn't even realize. Damn, those things go grow fast after you've uh, harvested them initially. That's pretty nice. It's a good summer crop. Finally making some, some money now, huh? Get out of here. Oh, that was wheat, apparently. I didn't realize that was a crop I was growing. There you go. Pure serenity resumes. Nothing but bliss, nothing but crops and a doggo. And a lovely little farm. We're gonna be making some big money with this eventually, man. I'm kinda tempted to go ahead and invest even further in the farm here. I think. More than anything, I'd like to try to find a way to automate this watering a little bit better. Obviously, we tried to do that with the sprinklers to very little effect. There must be a better way. There's got to be a better way. Oh, yeah, we have that ancient fruit, too. Did I just save that, or did I try to sell that? I think I just put that in my inventory, didn't I? Or in one of these chests. Let's go take a look. Yeah, we're just sitting on an ancient fruit here. It's been dormant for eons. Hmm. I mean... We're gonna grow another one, right? I'll sell it. See what it's worth. Just out of curiosity. Oh, don't forget to water it, though. 
Hmm. All right. Back to the mines. Not a lot of money, or not a lot of money, a lot of food this time, but we do need some more copper ore and stone. I don't know how likely it is we're going to be finding a lot of copper ore in the mines level we're on, but maybe you can find something better anyway. Let's go for it. I'll swing by the saloon since they'll usually, or since they'll probably be open by the time we get over there. Yeah, I was thinking about maybe going to some shallower depths, like 10s and 20s. I'm going to try out the lower ones and see if I get lucky with those. And if not, we might spend a little bit of time there and rebuild a bit. I'm just going to swing by and drop off this geode real fast, too. I guess can't really be too surprised. Gold pickaxe. I probably want to go ahead and work on getting that, don't I? Five gold bars, which we almost have already, I'm pretty sure. It's all about making that money now. Which it has been for a while. I mean, when is it not? Stardew Valley. The capitalism simulator. Whoa, sick. Somebody threw out a jade. Yeah, these are pretty expensive. Plus one speed. That's nice. Big energy boost from these things, I, I, I guess, but uh, I don't know how much money I want to spend on them. Let's just get like two. Two breads ought to do it. Yeah, I've taken a look at the community center. I haven't really been super tempted to... Uh, spend a lot of time on it. I know the rewards are probably pretty good, but I don't know. It just feels like busy work, dude. Here's 40 lists of items. Go get them all. Nah, I'm cool. I'm gonna go mining. Maybe do some fishing. And then if I happen to remember that there's a thing that you need, maybe I'll bring it. But probably not. We go. Four one hundred. I haven't even gone beyond this point yet. I don't think. Give it a try. It's such a good weapon now too. Really liking this sword. All right, easy. Four one complete. Let's see what the odds are that we end up with a copper ore here. Yep. Nice. Yeah, the Void Essence and I think there's one other thing that you can get from these enemies that ends up being very valuable too. Even further incentive to go this route. I think it is the Void Essence. I'm pretty sure that's the one that's worth a ton. A little stone out of that guy too. Nice. I'll grab this quartz real quick. It's crazy that the slimes are the tankiest of the lot now. Golden shirt and a shadow dagger. Ooh, fun. It's a shiny golden shirt. It sure is. Well, now I feel fancy. I need some bear greed for my gold shirt. Head on down. Solar Essence, yeah, that's a pretty valuable one, too, isn't it? I think there's two valuable things in here, actually. I think the Dark Matter and the Solar Essence will sell for quite a bit. Banger, by the way? Banger alert. Ooh, diamond? Diamond, hell yeah. Big money. Yep. Still plenty of energy, too. Really, the time is the biggest issue now, for sure. As 
long we're going to be able to hang out down here. I really haven't been prioritizing the copper all that much, but I am still pretty focused on just making number get bigger. Especially after we got such good loot from getting to floor 100. Why not go deeper and deeper? Nothing really much stopping me so far, anyway. Until I see, like, a, like a firm no from the game as far as, like, our ability to make progress through the mines. I'm going to be pretty tempted to keep it up. Yeah, what the hell? That was a sneaky play. There we go. Ooh, ghosts? Oh my god. Oh, okay. That's new. I see you. Oh, that's easy to kill, though. Okay. Ow. Owie. Stop it. Okay, I gotta be more careful against them. Let's have a slice of bread real quick. That's better. Ooh. This could be good. Oh my god. Ooh, a lot of gold here too, I think. Nice. This is looking promising. Oh, shit. I'll tank here on that one. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we go side, right? Ah, damn. Payday. With the cave carrots in there, too. Nice. That'll help out. Oh, these jerks. They're sneaking in there yourself a hot pepper, buddy. Alright, let's see if I can find some god dang copper. Getting a couple of geodes out of it already. There's a quick stop at 105. Quick shout out to my own rap album. Exclamation point rap. Check out my song 105. It's pretty good. If you ask me, in my humble opinion. One of those hits now is pretty concerning. That's a lot of damage. Let's get this guy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yikes. Now we. Hold on. A little bit of bread. That's why we bought it. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Careful. Careful. Ooh, that was a big crit. Wow. What the fuck was that? Sometimes the combat's real weird, man. Just lunging out of nowhere. Okay. I may want to already call it here. I'm beginning to think that this is definitely not the place to find too much copper, but we got a few hours left. Plenty of energy still. Let's see how lucky we can get. Too lucky so far. A lot of stone, though. There we go. I wonder how much the gold ore sells for. I wonder if even without a furnace we might be able to get some value out of that. I like the amount of slimes down here. Oh, you son of a bitch. This is bad. Let's maybe get a cave carrot going. Oh, nice. Extremely convenient. As long as I can get him backed into a corner, we're feeling good. But until that happens, it's pretty sketchy. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Okay, here we go. These guys are easy. Ooh, more diamond. Yes, please. Hell yeah, 
it, dude. All right, already a pretty worthwhile expedition here, huh? I feel like we got like 40 gold ore, too. 28, pretty nice. Well, 11 p.m., though. Becoming less and less likely that we're able to push this on to the next area, but yet another diamond. Wow, that's incredible. Oh, God. Oh, my God, it freaked me the hell out. <laughs> Oh, that got me good. Oh, bouncy crab boy, okay. Give me that. Is that two diamonds? Oh my goodness. Okay, now it's very quickly becoming time to go. Let's not lose out on this. Yeah, let's get out of here. Especially with the enemies starting to surge. That is time to take the W. That is a big payday. Got a lot of geodes out of that. Oh yeah, I have a bunch of cherry bombs still, I forgot. And we got a little bit of grub for next time too. All right. I'm gonna check the calendar on the way back, see if there's maybe somebody I can help out tomorrow. There was some kind of fishing event happening soon, wasn't it? I think it might have been like, like next week though. Ooh, slay two crab stones. I can do that tomorrow. Wish I'd seen that today, though. Tomorrow is Sam's birthday, and then it's also the book seller the day after that. Which means we want to make a lot of money to spend on her. I think I called it just in time for tonight, too. I think we're going to be able to get back to the bed right before I collapse. Let's see what we can sell real quick here. Get rid of the void essence, get rid of the stone, the slime, keep that copper ore for now, get rid of the bat wings, the diamond, the jade. Uh, get rid of the, uh, oh, we gotta donate the emerald actually. Okay, cool. And get rid of the crab too, yeah, why not? That'll do. Uh, coal in there, got some geodes to break open. I'm gonna keep this, I'm gonna keep the shadow, shadow dagger in my inventory. Boom, boom, boom. Get some gold ore as well, nice. Geodes for later, and then we're gonna bring these stuff to Gunther. Nice. Good day. Good day. Happily call that a night. Wow. Five G's. Ancient fruit sells for seven fifty-five. Pretty damn good. All right. Well, that's one good use for it, at least. I got the cowpoke achievement. Cool. I think that just means I made 50 grand or something. Alrighty. Trying to slay two lava crabs for Demetrius today. Let's get back to watering. Our, uh, our tradition now is to uh, bear dance during the watering process, so if you guys wouldn't mind helping me out with that. Get some bear dances going in chat. Yeah. Ooh, more hops. Man, these things are very quick. That's awesome. Nice buds sprouting here. Summer jams, baby. Yo, and super duper handsome. Just had some, su some success with you in the DD runs. Welcome back. Give me a few bear hugs while you're at it, too. Thank you for the support. Appreciate it. Go. Goodness, look how much energy that cost me now. That is a hefty energy price. We are growing a heck of a lot. Can I get one more? Oh my god. It's so close. It's so close to the perfect amount of water. 
Oh, that's true, isn't it? That's right, I totally forgot about the spa, which we can visit on our way over to the mine. That's a great point. I should do exactly that. I think I will do exactly that. I wonder if I have enough for another furnace now. Nah, I think I need like 20, right? Alright, so be it. Let's see here. I'm gonna bring these geos. I'm gonna go ahead and sell this flower. Oh, and I'll give this to whoever's birthday it is. I'll pretend I remembered. I mean, I did. Give yourself some credit, Barry. You're being a nice guy. Going out of your way here. Speaking of going out of my way, let's hit that spa. Right after I hopefully find Sam. Oh, yeah, I did fail to check the TV today, too. My bad. Oh, the blacksmith's open now, right? I think they opened at 9. Could knock that stuff out, too. The local pike population is starting to threaten our other species. Oh, cool, you can keep the fish. Fish to pike. Sounds good. And we're looking for Sam. Where the heck is Sam's house? Sam lives on One Willow Lane, right down there. Let's see how he's doing. Hey, Vincent. I want to look for bugs, but Mom gets mad when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. Yeah, best of luck with that, bud. There's Sam. Locked away in his room. Uh, well, alright. Here. Did you ever come out? No. Oh, well, never mind. Alright, fine. I'll come back later, I guess. God, I really love having that third inventory slot, man. That's already been really nice. Huge upgrade. I love the era of TV when it was actually fun to watch. The late night programs were great sometimes. I think that we're in the best era of TV we've ever been in. It just unfortunately coincides with the most saturated era of TV we've ever been in. Which logically checks out too, but... Yeah, there's a lot of garbage, but there's also like shows that are leagues beyond anything we used to get. Iridium ore is new. This is a thunder egg. Oh, shit. That seems cool. Barite as well. Bear pun, bear pun. A little iron ore. Nice. It's another new thing. Tiger's eye. Damn, we're going to have a lot of stuff to donate. Those geodes went well. Like, imagine watching Three Body Problem in 2010. Some next level shit, man. Go all the way over there. I am kind of organizing them at this point. Jade Hills. Cool. Excuse me, Vincent. I appreciate your uh, enthusiasm for the arts, but you can go ahead and get the hell out of the way, too. The moonlight jellies will be here soon. It's one of my favorite things about the valley. Pike? I'm going to guess pike is an ocean fish. I also did want to take a peek at the available rod upgrades. So let's do that. Right after I forage. Ooh, nice. Mm -hmm. There we go. I miss Saturday morning cartoons. We have had a lot of good conversation about Saturday morning cartoons. Oh man, best uh, best theme song debate. That was a good time. I too am a fan. What you got now, bud? Let's see. Iridium rod used to catch fish. You know what? Don't mind if I do. I'll snag that. Let's see. The shape around, or the shape makes it spin around in the water slightly increases the bite rate when fishing. 
Shows what fish is on the line before it's caught. That's pretty cool. Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. Ooh. Adds weight to your fishing bar, preventing it from bouncing along the bottom. Ooh, that's pretty nice, too. I think I'll take the trap bobber. I think that's a pretty good upgrade. And then let's get some bait. How's this fish to bite even faster increases the size of the fishing bar? Ooh, nice. Real fancy ass bait. Really good bait. Much more expensive bait. Let's get some cheap bait too. And apparently I'm going fishing. Apparently going fishing, which is fine with me. I don't mind doing a little fishing. Equip that uh, upgrade there. Let's try out the deluxe bait. See what we can find. Cereal with the cartoons. That is a tried and true combo. That's a PB and J experience right there. Ooh, I already really like the trap reel. That is a significant upgrade. Makes it a lot easier. Tilapia, cool. And a geo, nice. All right, yeah, hold on, I gotta redo the bait. Used our deluxe one on the tilapia, which feels like a bit of a waste. Yeah, no spoilers, ideally, Nate. Thanks for asking, though. Yeah, I think I'm all right with just experimenting and finding out on my own. Perfect. Nice. Right, looks like we ain't getting much but tilapia here. And if I want to knock out that other quest for Demetrius, I'm going to have to hit the caves pretty soon. Oh, come on. This way. This way. Get up here. All right, fine. That was smooth. Nice. I had tilapia last night. Tilapia is one of the fish that I don't mind. I'm generally pretty averse to seafood, but tilapia is pretty tasty. It's the chicken of the sea. I got some bonus energy for the mining here, too, from the fishing I did, so... That works. Just eat that shit raw right out of the ocean. Delicious. I could swing by the spa, too, if I wanted. I feel like I'm, I'm so low on time already, it might not be worth it, but... Yeah, let's go for it. It'll be nice. Where is this again? It's beyond the carpenter or whatever it is up here, right? Eating a raw fish out of the water is very on brand for a bear. Good point. Not wrong. Sneaky back row. We got a couple of uh, harvesting options down there, uh, foraging options down there, too. Yeah, I'm gonna be a little low on time, but let's swing through here real quick at least. It's so funny. I, did, I remember seeing Elise go here all the time on her playthrough. Now I understand why. Uh, it's a bear cult, I believe, would be the best, be the most representative of this experience. Just pure zen. Oh. Energy recovered. That'll do. Not a lot of great fishing in Utah, I guess. Yeah, the Great Salt Lake ain't really known for its fishing. Being landlocked otherwise, not a lot of opportunities. Although there are a few ponds around. People make do. Man, I really just wish I had more time now. We actually ended up getting a pretty good energy setup over here. 
Can't believe I get to witness a bear hot tub stream. It was only a matter of time, right? Until I, until I conformed. All right, let's see if I can knock out a quick five stages here. I guess the biggest priority is to try to find those crab boys for Demetrius. Love backpacking in Utah, though. Oh, sure, yeah, no, it's got other environmental benefits, no doubt. Beautiful national parks. Zion's is gorgeous. A lot of really nice, like, cliff areas, too, and, like, uh, chasms and that kind of thing. Look really awesome. Freaking Moab, yeah, no kidding, huh? It's got its, it's got its positives, certainly. Oh, that's why I freaked out, right? Because this is where those crab things show up. They don't pop up until you hit them? I felt like they usually moved when you got nearby. Oh, this isn't going well. Yeah, we're certainly not gonna expect to get the copper out of these levels, I guess. It felt like they were dumping, or they were, uh, a chance to be looted from the barrels and the boxes, right? So hopefully we can find some more of those. But geez, this is... This is not the first level I was hoping for. It's already been like two or three hours. It's like one out of 40 for the copper. Okay, yeah, we're probably not going to get that in here then. Hmm. I think one of the enemies dropped some too. Oh, okay, that makes sense. There we go, finally, sheesh. Alright, really just looking for the, uh, for the enemy at this point, I guess. Which means I guess I gotta walk by all these guys. There's no, like, experience system, right? I keep fooling myself into thinking it's worth killing all these enemies, because I'm... Well, I guess I'm probably training, like, my combat level. I think there is something like that, actually, is there? It might be worthwhile. Squid ink, huh? Okay. Yeah, I suppose there is some benefit to it. Nice. More diamonds, outstanding. Gotta be squid ink. You good? That's that's good. I like that. Give me a full point, full merits on that one. I think there might have been another diamond over here. There was at least a crater too. Hold on. Inventory full. Really? Wow. That's shocking. Um, let's do this. Pop the white algae real quick. Man, I can't believe I filled up the inventory already. And we can have that, I guess. Oh, right. Yeah, I guess I did slip by Gunther's real quick and he gave me a few new things. That makes more sense now. Let's use a few cherry bombs. Oh, wait, no, I already found the ladder. That's right, shit. Oh, that's convenient, I guess. You will go ahead and use a couple more here, though. Ow. Nice ladder. Good stuff. Oh, my God, 128 damage in a single hit. That's crazy. There is some gold down here. I don't know if it's worth... I don't think so. I think we're already pretty late. I gotta make sure I get to the final stage. Oh, sick. There we go. I'll just look for another mushroom boy, I guess. <laughs> okay, sick. Yeah, we're just trying to find the disguised guys now. Which are not showing up anymore. Oh, there's some copper. That's convenient. Cool. Oh, I've got full inventory again. Sheesh. I'm just going to need that. Cool. Mm -hmm. Worth 
while in here now. Now. There we go. Cave carrots. Ooh, that's an instant teleport. Love that. Um, I'm going to have my fish here. Yum, yum, yum. That was a max rank fish, but oh well. Grab that totem so I can warp out of here. Alright, that'll do. Good enough. I think it's time to boogie. I can hang on to this totem for next time. Nice. Space boots. An iridium weave gives them a purple sheen. Sick. Hell yeah, dude. Space, space boots coots to coots. That doesn't feel good saying. But my, my brain wouldn't let me not. Another great day in the mines. Plenty of stuff to shell. Music that reminds you of Axiom Verge. Oh man, that's a good that's a good game. Good soundtrack too. Never did find Sam to give him his birthday present, unfortunately. Well I tried, but he was spending his birthday moping in his bed. I haven't unlocked minecarts yet. No, I haven't really had anything indicate to me that that was even an option, actually. As far as I can tell, anyway. Right, let's go ahead and sell these guys. Sell the tilapia, get rid of the slime, stone, wood. I'll sell that guy. Just out of curiosity. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I got a bomb. Nice. An aquamarine. Cool. Put the ore away. Organize this real quick. And then, boom, 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 boom. I need to make more space, I guess. I'm gonna get rid of some of these not great weapons, actually. Not a lot of reason to hang on to them in my mind. I don't know if you can like sell them or something at some point, but. Wait, can I put them in here? No, okay, yeah, let's just get rid of them. Go away, go away, go away, and go away. There we go. Put my fiberglass rod into here. That's better. Okay. And then you go in there. Let's see. Keep you. Keep you for later. Um, swing by the blacksmith again, right? Yeah, okay, good. And then put the iron ore in the chest. Nice. Okay, I think we're good. Let's put up a painting that's the the size of my entire house. Oh, we really don't even have any space for it, do we? <laughs> All right, well, that's for later, I guess. Good day. Off we go. I've done a little bit of fishing in the mines, not very much. I should give it another shot. See what we can find. booksellers in town. That's right. Living off the land. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen. Summer's known for its lightning storms. If you know how to craft a lightning rod, you can harvest the electricity and create battery packs. Cool. Do I know how to make a lightning rod? No. That's good to know for later, though. Okay. Another report. Ooh, storm's approaching. Thunder and lightning is expected. How convenient that I learned that just now. Ooh, we got a lot of stuff. Pepper time. Nice. Ooh, big payday. Big payday. It's melon harvesting season. Right, let's dump these guys off. And get back to watering. Get back to your bear dance, y'all. 
It's that time again. Ooh, we're selling a bunch today. That's fantastic. All right, watering can retrieved. Back to work. Oh, he's mad. I forgot to water him. Sorry, buddy. Hang on. I'm coming. I need water. I know. I know you do. There you go. So the melons certainly seem like the best summer fruit so far. Although I definitely love how frequently the hops have been generating, but I don't know how much those have been selling for. I haven't really been paying enough attention. The melons have been very profitable, though. Oh, man, it would be so perfect if we had a hat modifier for emotes on Twitch. Like the sunglasses. Little bear chubs with a hat on. I'll write a letter to Mr. Twitch. See what they can do. Time is a factor. True, yeah, I guess it depends on how much time you got left in the season. Early on, though, certainly seems like they're a good investment. I might even just go all melons. Oops, all melons. Is one of these done? No, okay. Grow what's in your heart. Spoken like a true Stardew Valiant. Amen to that. Right, now... Go ahead and leave this in the chest for the moment. Same with the squid ink, I think. We've got no need for the master slingshot or the copper hoe anymore. Reorganize the inventory a little bit. Let's get these geodes cracked. Got some cave carrots for later. And our totem just in case. Sweet. Off we go. Looks like your tapper to the east is done. Do I have a tapper down there? You mean the west? You mean weast? That's right. Keep forgetting this is here. Sweet. That's West Patrick. You're fired again. Um, I'll just sell it again. I only have a lot of use for it, apparently. Well, I'm sure I do. I just don't know what it is yet. Well, let's see whose notice board mission I'll fail today. I need melon to power my... God damn it. <laughs> Wait, can I get it back? Can I get it back from the chest and just put it all in there? Nope. All right. Well, fuck. Oh, yeah, the bookseller. Let's go see what they got going on. Oh, that's a damn shame, dude. I guess I gotta check that before I sell all my shit. I don't think I got nearly enough money for this, but I'll go give it a look at least. Hey there. Trade in books. Oh, I'll trade useful stuff for your extra books. Well, I don't have any extra books, but that's that's cool. What do you got? Gain combat experience, foraging, some farming. You run a little bit faster. Oh my god, I want that so badly. Horse, horse the book is, this This is artistic perfection. The, the, the design perfection, this is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Name and image really is, I guess it's all that I'm interpreting here, but. Just the horse face on the cover, clearly in 3D. Ah, chef's kiss. Now just name your horse book. <laughs> <laughs> horse the book for book the horse. Yeah, that is that is terrific. 
Um, all right, I think I'm going back to the mines again. I can't seem to pull myself away. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I was going to go sw swim by Gunther. Buy the horse book and your horse will be booking it. Plus two no-notes. All right, quick little geode popping spree. Probably a few more things for the museum down here as well. And then we're heading back. We got five cave carrots and a few bombs after all. I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to make some good progress today too. Also old? No, that's new lemon stone. Just playing all kinds of fun sounds this time. Iron ore, and then a little sandstone. All right, or oh no, earth crystal. Cool. Is any of that new? I don't think so. I'll go swing by here just in case, but I don't think any of these are museum worthy. Oh, this one is nice. All right. It rings out with a pure tone when struck. The singing stone. Cool. Okay. Well, a big priority has all of a sudden become saving up $15,000 so I can buy the speed upgrade from the bookkeeper. I would very much like that. Yeah, no, I know that Android. I just didn't want to do that for all the items. All right. Half day for the mines. That's that's good enough for me. What isn't really, I guess, at this point. Well, especially with the totem, actually. I should be able to spend a pretty good amount of time down here now. I should check on the Adventurer's Guild, too, see what's going on with them lately. Based on the way that this looks, I feel like we might be getting close to the end, but it's entirely possible that I have no idea what I'm talking about. In fact, it's pretty damn likely. I don't think I need to care about the Mushroom Boys anymore. I certainly want to go for some diamonds if I can find them, though. All about that. Ah, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, there we go. Oh, aquamarine, that'll work. That is an enemy, isn't it? What is this guy? That was a bat, okay. Well, never mind. Take the easy descent where I can, I guess. Okay, they have a longer range than I realized. That is not good. Let's go ahead and have a cave carrot real quick. Maybe two. Another diamond, possibly? Is this a bomb thing? It is a bomb slime, isn't it? it looks like it. You're gonna blow up, aren't you? You're absolutely gonna blow up. We're so tanky. Sheesh. Why are the slimes the tankiest enemies by far? Oh, level 8 sword. Pretty comparable. Plus 4 speed, plus 20 crit power, plus 2 attack. It's a better weapon. Let's go. Worth it. Another aquamarine, though. Okay. Nice. There's a door. Grab the gold real quick. Good stuff. Slime with a... Oh, that one had a star above it. I didn't realize. Okay. Got another easy descent here, too. I'm going to go ahead and grab these mushrooms real quick, though. Yum, yum, yum. All right, that's good enough. Take the easy ones where they give them to you. There's a quick 115. Okay. Two shot the bat feels pretty good. That's way better. All right. It looked like a bomb slime, didn't it? Yeah, I absolutely thought it looked like a bomb slime. And a look. 
Oh, there you are. God damn you. That fucking thing nearly killed me. Jesus. Sheesh. What else we got here? Mushroom's not gonna help, is it? Hmm. That's not great. Gotta be a little more careful here, I guess. Be very careful about the stealth guys. dead. In fact, let's go ahead and do this and then trigger him. No? Oh, that's not fair. There we go. There we go. Nice. Okay. Now let's go ahead and cherry bomb this. No luck. Okay, we'll do another one. Big fan of those cherry bombs now. It's helping a lot. Got another bat coming in here. Five enemies. Oh, sheesh. Kind of wish I had my slingshot. How in the world? Oh, the bats. Holy shit. Holy shit. The slime, too! Jesus. Jesus. Okay. Okay. This is intense. This is intense. Okay. We got the ladder too. Nice. Got a dwarf scroll out of that. Good, good, good. Let's get the hell out of here. One more floor. I think I may be done pushing my luck at that point. The bombs are super helpful. Yeah, I'm really glad I realized that too. That's been really nice. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. Holy shit. Holy shit. Woo! Okay. Okay. Intense expedition. There it is. Let's go. The lowest level? The lowest level? I've done it. You found the skull key. You're not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. Let's go. All right. Hell yeah, man. So now I'm guessing we probably can use this thing, right? No. All right. Maybe this person wants a skull key. Oh, maybe it opens this thing up. Um, It's been added to my wallet, which apparently is not my inventory. Okay. Olay to and so sando to be run to Olay. A hundred percent, dude. There's a weird little cave over there too. Interesting. Okay, cool. Let's head over to the Adventures Guild and see if maybe they want the skull key we just got. I feel like they might be interested. No, not at all. Oh, I can sell my weapons to them, though. And this stuff, of course. Yeah, that makes sense. Cool. And they've got other weapons I can get. And equipment. Well, I don't really care that much about their equipment, it turns out. Cool. Okay. Right on. Oh. Oh. Wow. Apparently he had a weapon for me. We're gonna try to slay all that stuff still. Quite a few other ones. I, apparently there's four enemies I've yet to see too. Interesting. I'm just gonna sell that thing. I'm not gonna use that. There's a gift back here. Slay 1,000 monsters to enter. Okay, I can probably do that. Oh! How the heck do I fix that? Interesting. Okay. Time for bed. No 
Another great day in the mines. Don't even have to use the warp totem again. And they didn't die, most importantly. What's the new update, Ed? Ah, uh, Chad, I'll have to help you on that one. I'm still a newbie. It's all new to me. All right, yeah, the scroll. We gave that to the museum already. I guess I just sell the other ones? Maybe I should keep them for the bookkeeper. No, I think that was different kinds of books she wanted. I don't think she wanted any scrolls. I think the hats on pets things was new, yeah. Her thing was new. All right, let's see. I'm gonna get some mushrooms. I'm gonna donate a ruby here. Got a couple of things to sell. Let's get rid of this guy. I'm gonna sell this mushroom just out of curiosity, see what it goes for. Get rid of the tiger's eye, the slime. Save this guy. Sell the quartz. I think it's our second squid ink, is it not? Yeah, nice. Oh yeah, the singing stone. Let's put this out here. Ding. Ding. That's fun. Um, okay, and then iron ore. Sell the fire quartz, sell the earth crystal. Cool. Alright, pretty good. Mm-hmm. All straightened out. I think that's a uh, us calling it a day. Stormy weather tomorrow too, which means I might go fishing. Level up combat. New slime egg press recipe. The crafting recipe for oil of garlic. Oh baby, look at the melons. Excellent. Twenty-five ondo. Beautiful. Stormy day, huh, Chubbs? It's actually turning into a bit of a stormy day here, too. The spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Oh, will I? Damn, the hops are like daily, aren't they? That's crazy. I'm loving that. Ooh, blueberries! Yay! Oh man, this is very satisfying. <laughs> I like this a lot. All right, that's a lot of blueberry shit. Let's go. I wonder if that mission's still up for the melon. Oh, some corn here too, nice. Look at all the harvest for today. Awesome, don't even have to water it. All right, let's go. Let's go see if that mission's available still, and then if not, I'm probably just gonna go fishing for a bit. Yeah, I want to try to save a melon for Mara and see if I can just give it to her now. I guess I should have put the other stuff away, but eh, whatever. I'll do it at the end of the day. Just cut, keep some inventory space. That's not a big deal, though. Eh, it doesn't look like it's up there anymore. Nothing posted today. Damn. Oh, well. It is Demetrius' birthday, though. Let's go give him a... I don't know what Demetrius would want. I wonder if he'd probably want a fish. I'll go get Demetrius a fish. I'll get that, uh, I'll get that pike that he was asking for, like, three days ago. Happy birthday, bud. Oh, cool. Upgraded forging, apparently. I'm gonna grab some bait for a session here, too. Good lord. Hello? Have I met you? Old Mariner. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, you've been here before. I think he only shows up on, like, rainy days. Probably wants me to do a lot of more fishing, I'd assume. 
Okay, once the blacksmith is open, I'm going to head up that way and crack our geodes. Donate the uh, museum stuff. Till then, though, let's go ahead and do some fishing. Oh, he's not uh, working today, apparently. Tomorrow is the annual trout derby. Ah, it's a freshwater enthusiast dream. That's right. It is the trout derby tomorrow. That's exciting. Good thing we upgraded our rod before that, huh? Pretty good timing. Oh, now you're gonna sell me bait? Oh, he was fishing before he opened shop. That makes sense. What a life. Well, he's got it figured out, huh? Yeah, I really like this new rod. I feel like it's making this a lot easier. Sweet. Oh, some gold ore, nice. Hey, I'm filling up my inventory pretty quick here, though. I'm probably gonna have to sort that out before I do too much more fishing today. Perfect. Sweet. All right, sell fish, buy bait, head over to the museum. Hot damn. Fishing rod equals lightning rod. Just hold it up in the air. Give it a shot. Why not? I've got it out, so I'm effectively just walking around like this. Come and get me, God! I kind of got loaded all of a sudden there. Oh, huh? yeah. 9K. Nice. Might actually be able to get that book after all. I think the book seller's coming back pretty soon, weren't they? Okay, process some geodes real quick. Copper ore. Ooh, that's new. Fire opal. Cool. I ain't, I ain't scared. Do your worst. Alright, you go here. That seems right. And then you go here? Sure. I didn't have a second one of those. I wonder if I could just sell that to the blacksmith real quick. Along with some of these other things. I wonder if he wants the scroll I've got. No, apparently not. Gold ore does sell for 25 a pop, though. Damn, that's pretty good. That's a lot more than I expected to get from that. Oh, I bet Pierre will just buy my veggies straight from me, too, won't he? Let's go try that. Jesus. They are trying to spook me with the lightning still, though. He will. I had anticipated as much. Yeah, that's pretty convenient. No further backpack upgrades, though, huh, bud? Look at that. All right, let's see how much these are going to go for, huh? Three grand for the bloobs. Hell yeah, brother. Uh, I'm going to save one melon just in case. Look at that. Nearly 15k already. Okay. I think we got enough time. Oh, we don't. You can see. Okay. Not quite enough time for those. We have enough time for tomatoes, though, I think. But it'd be a lot safer if I were to do something like maybe radishes. Yeah, let's do some radishes. That sounds like fun. 20 radishes. And the... Uh, fertilizer for it, and we'll just plant those and take advantage of our stormy day here. I would have expected Bear to be a trash digger. Every now and then I'll get in there and unearth a jade somebody dumped off unknowingly. It's 28, right? Yeah, I thought it was either 28 or 30 days. So, okay. That works. And we got some fertilizer in here, too. That's pretty convenient. Can I make some more? I think I have sap. A train is passing through. What? Is it a ghost train? I want to see. Where's the train tracks? That's way the hell up there. I ain't going to be able to get there in time. But I'm going to run. If only I'd gotten that book. Maybe I'd be able to make it. Run! Cool 
full speed. Gotta see what that's all about. Yeah, worst case, I'll just hang out in the spa for a day. Oh, wait, is it... Was it Demetrius' birthday today? Or was that a... Uh, was that another day? Oh my god, I, I did actually catch it, but maybe a little too late? Wait, I want to hitch a ride! Take me with you! Crap. Oh, speaking of, uh... Digging for garbage. No, oh, no, apparently not. All right. Seems impossible to budge. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I know what happens with that now. I don't even really need the energy. I don't need to go to the spa. Let's go fishing. What's over here? Oh, this is just a path to connect down the other way, isn't it? That's good to know, I guess. Because I want to take this route. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, okay. I see. I should just go ahead and clear the path here anyway. There you go, buddy. That's more like it. Oh, there's hardwood from that. What was I going to use hardwood for? I had a recipe that I wanted to use that with. The mayonnaise machine. The worm bin. Let's see if I can find some more hardwood real quick. I'm curious to make that. I could get, get a consistent source of bait. Can somebody come by and give you something in your cave, too? Did they? I don't remember. Fiber, hardwood... Iron and gold bars, which I think our gold bars are in here. There we go. Let's whip this sucker up. A worm bin. Sounds like fun. Cool. And then that's just going to make bait, I guess? That's pretty dope. Okay, and then we're looking for sap again so we can make some more fertilizer. Nice. Put that away for now. And that and that. Good stuff. And the fiber. Oh, cool. A mahogany seed. Yeah, I can plant that. Um, right, right here. There you go. Enjoy. All right, this is going to be our new radish area. Sweet. Easy peasy. Okay. And then one more melon almost ready to go. Might as well go ahead and plant the other two of these guys. Cool. All right. Now, put the wood and the stone away. Whoa, what the hell? Just destroyed my path. That's fun. I'll fix that real quick. There we go. Um, I do still need to make the furnace. Yeah, hold on. Let me see if I've got that stuff, too, because I think we might have enough copper ore at this point. If we look through both, but uh, maybe not. We have the stone, at least. Oh, we can make one. Nice. There we go. That's better. Okay. We're fixed. It's like we never bombed the front of the house after all. And then stone gets put away. The wood gets put away. I think the stone actually might be in a different one. Hold on. There we go. Ah, apparently that's all we got. Um, keep this for now. And then, what was I going to do? Oh, I was going to put the, uh, the ore and the coal in here. Make some more gold bars. Yeah, I could use another furnace still, probably. we got a lot of gold and ore. Got to whip some more gold bars up. 
takes a while to make some bait, too. All right, back to fishing. I'm going to remember where this path leads me to. Oh, this got destroyed, too, apparently. This just goes right to the beach, right? Or a part of the beach, at least. Oh, no, this is a little pond back here. That's right. These poor cows. They're in the middle of the damn lightning storm. I guess they are doing it voluntarily. They could just as easily go back in the barn. All right, yeah, we'll just do a little more ocean fishing to wrap this day up. That sounds about right. Got to imagine we can have a chance of some uh, decent fish on a stormy day. Got plenty of bait, too, so we're good to go there. Now we just kick back. The barely visible bear. That's how you know he's chilling. Kind of undersold the significance of that. I guess we did already get it once before, but the sea jellies are really, really good find. There's another one. Whoa. Oh, it did say I was a little more lucky today, didn't it? So that's probably contributing to the sea jelly. Cool. Okay. Bear lean, but opposite. Right, yeah, no, it's like how we need the bear roll in reverse for the backing it up in DD. It's it's the bear lean. I mean, it kind of looks like that already, if you just ignore the first half of the animation. Oh, shit. Uh-oh, here we go. Okay, this is why we got that upgrade. This is why we got the uh, the trap reel or whatever it is. So we can catch ones like this. But it's still easier said than done, obviously. Gotcha. Ooh, baby. Cool. Super cucumber. What the heck? That don't look like no damn cucumber, dude. That ain't no, that ain't no cucumber I've ever seen. A rare purple variety of a sea cucumber. Gold star, too. Nice. That's cool. Pickle it, yeah. <laughs> okay, another one of those bad boys, huh? Very lucky today, indeed. Gotcha. Oh, cool. Pretty sure we got plenty of inventory left over, so I think I can go ahead and fish to my heart's content tonight. And get some more super cucumbers, huh? How about that? Man, these are still very tricky. A lot more likely to not be uh, breaking the line on us, though. Let's go. A second one, even bigger that time. And another gold star. That's awesome. And a pair of broken specs. Balancing all things. That had some drama. Perfect. A perfect halibut. Come on, one more cucumber. The thrill of the catch alone is, is is what I'm seeking from that. Because sure, it's nice to get some easy ones every now and then, but it just feels particularly good to hunt those down. How far out can you see events on the calendar? I think it shows for the entire month. Every season. But you can't see into the next season. Which I suspect probably has something to do with like the way it generates 
I've been liking the fishing a lot too. Yeah, I've been fishing and mining more than anything by far. Those have been my favorite things to do for sure. Now that we've exhausted our mining, though, I think we'll probably be doing a little more fishing. Night storm fishing. Thanks for jumping on your queue there, God. I get a max cast, damn it. Just wondering when the bookseller comes back. Oh, yeah, 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 that's true. I did want to go check on that again, because I think she's coming, like, tomorrow, actually. Which will be a big day. Well, first of all, I think the uh, the trout competition is tomorrow as well, so I'm looking forward to that, too. I'm about to save that for next time, though. It seems like a good way to wrap things up for today. Just a little more fishing tonight, though. Yeah, I appreciate that. I uh, appreciate that, Kaboli. I feel like it's a really good fit for me. And as as uh, as much as I'd like it for it to be, you know, more popular of a series for me, I am very glad that the the folks that are watching it are still super into it. Like often for series uh, that I do on my channel. You know, it's literally every series, the, the views chart goes like this, right? Like, kind of, it starts up at a peak, and then it flattens out and, you know, just retains the folks that are going to be in it for the long haul. But normally, uh, coinciding with that is, like, you know, the uh, lower engagement rates, you know, like, less, less people commenting, less people liking that kind of thing. But it's been very consistent with the Stardew uploads of people being like, please do more of this. Like, <laughs> the people that are watching it, are are very invested and uh, that uh, that gives me a lot of incentive to continue so I'm, I'm glad folks are still digging it okay that's it that's all we got it's about time to head back anyway in fact yeah I should, I should probably go ahead and oh hold on oh one more sea cucumber come on come on this is where the bear greed pays off. Give it to me. Give it to me. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Three super cucumbers. Damn. Payday. Now to sprint home and hopefully not collapse before we get there. I think I dumped my totem, didn't I? Yeah, that's unfortunate. I wish I had that now. Hopefully I can sneak up there in time. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Run, run, run. Run, buddy. Oh, I do have my totem. I should just use it. I should just go. Yeah, I should just use this now. Let's just do it now. Let's not take the risk. Why on earth did it put me there? Oh, my God. If I still collapse. Come on. Thank God. <laughs> that was close. All right, sick. Um, chance for double harvest of foraged items or trees drop 25% more wood. I think I'll get the double items here. Yeah, it seems a lot, a lot better. Terrific. All right. Great way to wrap up for today. Good stuff in Stardew Valley. Thanks a bunch for watching, everybody. Please leave likes on the video. They do help quite a bit if you're one of those folks that is still sticking around for the YouTube series. Makes an enormous difference. The likes on the videos helps quite a bit. Please continue to do so. And thank you very much for your support. Uh, more Stardew to come. I'll see you then.